Hello, my people. How are you doing? I am coming to teach you English language. This is a wonderful lesson we are going to learn today. Today, I'm going to teach you about adjectives. We are going to talk about adjectives. What are adjectives? That is the lesson of today. We are going to see some examples of adjectives and sentences as well. Try to stick to this channel. You are going to get wonderful package. You are going to get wonderful packages in English language. Good. Then adjectives. But before we start this lesson, I would like to give you some announcements. Have you ever registered to Zoom? Have you ever studied English on Zoom? Zoom? If you have never studied English there on Zoom, this is your right time to learn English in a very good atmosphere. Mujukuri nibutari jeze wiki chonje za kuri zoom nunganya wawo. Second, are you a new student? That is my question. Urumunye shuri mushasha. If you are a new student, you should immediately subscribe to our channel to get the lessons each and every time we upload them. Niba urumunye shuri musha, kanda kuri subscribe utara nareba nisomu. Ivyo vira gufasha. It is going to help you so much. Good. Because if you subscribe, you are going to get the lessons each and every time. The, the, third, the third announcement is this one. Have you ever read this wonderful book? If not, this is your right time to buy it and read it. If you want to increase your level, if, if you want to enhance your English, to develop your English, to improve your English level, please buy this wonderful book, An Overview of English Tenses. The last thing that I want to tell you is this one. Are you sending these lessons to your friends and relatives? Are you doing that? If yes, you are helping them. Uh, Nice. Good. Then we are going to study, we are going to talk about, we are going to talk about adjectives. What are adjectives? But before, I'd like to show you the word of today. This word is an adjective. This is an adjective, which is gorgeous. Gorgeous. I, I really like this word in my life. Because gorgeous is something that is very beautiful, or someone who is very beautiful, gorgeous. For example, you can say, you have a gorgeous student. Very beautiful. A gorgeous person. Very beautiful. It was a gorgeous event. It was a very beautiful event. Beautiful or beautiful? When I talk about gorgeous, I mean very beautiful, very cute. For example, you can say, Janet is a gorgeous woman. Or Janet is a gorgeous girl. These people are gorgeous. I have a gorgeous daughter at home. Gorgeous means very cute or very beautiful. Very beautiful. Good. Then uh, the word gorgeous is used both for things or for people. Yes. Ishora gukoresh kwa kubano changwa se ibinu uvuga ichinu chiza chane umunu mniza chane. Tuza koresha ijambo gorgeous. Gorgeous. Don't say gorgeous. No, gorgeous. No. Gorgeous. Just. Just. Gorgeous, gorgeous, nice. What are adjectives? Adjectives are words that talk about, adjectives are words that talk more about nouns. Or adjectives are words that describe nouns. Adjectives are words that explain more about nouns. Adjectives, namagambo, an adjective is a word 
that describes a noun or it is a word that talks more about noun. Yes, it is a word that talks more about a noun. That is an adjective. Muyandi magambo nicho twita ikinyazina cyangwa ibinyazina na magambo asobanura mazina. We are going to see nouns, the definition of nouns. What are nouns? Nouns are names of people, things, animals, or places. Those are nouns. Nouns are names of people, things, animals, or places. Nouns nibyo bita amazina. Na amazina yiki yabantu ibintu inyamaswa cyangwa ahantu nibyo twita amazina twarabibonye umusomo ya mbere tugitangira yes then here we are going to see some examples of adjectives first of all kugira ngo wumbe isomo first of all we are going to talk about some examples of adjectives the word beautiful or beautiful ugly smart silly angry dark, selfish, messy, muddy, humble, intelligent, wise, dirty, amazing, funny, cold, hot, big, bad, and so on, etc., etc. These are adjectives. These are adjectives. Beautiful, ugly, smart, silly, angry, dark, selfish, messy, muddy, humble, intelligent, wise, dirty, amazing, funny, cold, hot, big, bad. Nandi magambo yose tuzarewa. Aya magambo rero asobanura yerekana amazina imiterere ya mazina tuzayita adjectives. For example, I can say, you have a beautiful daughter. Ufite umukobga mngiza. Beautiful. Ndi kugaragazu umukobga ni mukobga chi. Ni mngiza. Beautiful daughter. She is an ugly girl. Nu mukobga mubi. Kuisur. Ugly. I am going to buy a smart television. Okay, you are wearing a smart sweater. Silly. Silly numuskwa. We don't have silly students in our class. Havanya shiro vaskwa dofite. Urumba koturi kugaragaza students ni noun. That is a noun, students. Okay? Havanya shiro. Turi kugaragaza havanya shiro vavaribo. Vavaskwa. Silly students. Okay? Angry. Huh? For example, you can say, she has an angry face. Apiti sura yijimye. Changwa se isura ilimu mujinya. Good. Here, I don't like to live in a dark room. Or I can't live in a dark room. Sinshora kuwa mchumba chijimye. Dark room. Turku garagazi chochumba chibeze gute. That's why that, the, the word dark is an adjective because it is explaining, it is talking more about the word room. Irikugaragaza, mubyukuri, the relationship between that room and the word dark. Yes, there is the relationship between dark and room. I don't like to live, or uh, I can't live in a dark room. The word selfish. Janet is a selfish girl. Janet numukogawichi wikunda. And so forth. Messy means what? Messy ni chinu chandu ye. For example, oh, I can't sit on this messy chair. Sinshora kuichara kuri inhebe yandu ye. Messy. Muddy. Muddy means ichinu cho sechiri mujitaka. Muddy bricks. Amatafari ya rukarakara uri atu ushwa kuita. Muddy bricks. Here, humble. Uwichi shabugufi. He is a humble person. Numunu uwichi shabugufi chana. Then intelligent. 
These are intelligent students. Then the word wise. Eh? Wise. Umunu ufitu genje karemano. Muhanga gakondo. Umuhanga chan. You can say, this is a wise man. Uyumugabo afitu genje ko. Wise. Abafite wisdom. Good. Then dirty. Dirty. You have dirty clothes. Ufite imyenda yandui. Amazing. Ibinu biri wonderful. Virenze. Huh? She told me an amazing story yesterday. Ejo ya mge yinguru itangaj. Nziza chan. Good. Amazing. Funny. Huh? That is a funny singer. Uriya muririmji. Arashimishishi. Arasekeje. Funny singer. Then here, cold. Cold. I don't need hot water. Please bring to me cold water. Cold water. Amazi akonje. Cold. Irikugaragazi. Nuvango ichochinu cold. Chirigusoba anurayomazi. Cold water. That is an adjective. Your cold ni adjective because it is explaining, it is talking more about the noun water. Cold water, not hot water. Big, big. For example, you can say, we have a big party or party. We have a big party today. We must do fite ibirori. Go say, vite yugova. We have a big party today. Bad. Oh, don't get long with, don't get along with that boy. He is a bad boy. Yes. We chudika. We shakubu shuti. Nuria muhungu. Nu muhungu mubichan. He is a bad boy. Don't get along with him. To get along with. Good. Nice. Then we are going to see examples of nouns. Kwa examples of adjectives. Nouns like girl, woman, television, student, face, room, people, table, rod, man, dog, old man, story, water, tea, country, behaviors. These are nouns. Then here we can see examples of adjectives in sentences. Smart television, intelligent students, a beautiful girl, uh, a selfish woman, things like that. Then let us see some examples of adjectives in sentences. I saw a beautiful girl in town. I didn't see an ugly girl in town. Only what I saw was a beautiful girl in town. Then the word beautiful is an adjective. It is explaining this word girl, which is a noun. I saw a beautiful girl. Nabonye umukoga mniza mumuji. Adjective, noun. Okay? Then she is an ugly woman, but she has a good heart. She is an ugly woman. Numugore mubi kwisura. But she has a good heart. She has a good heart. Good. I see a smart TV. television smart TV. It's not round TV. That traditional TV that we used to have last years ago. A smart TV. Yes. In a dark room. Because television is smart. It is modern. In a dark room. Muchumba chijim. Good. Joseph is a selfish boy. I am explaining, I am talking more about this boy who is called Joseph. Joseph is a selfish boy. Joseph numu hungu wikunda. Good. I can't sit on this messy chair. This messy chair. This word messy is an adjective because it is talking more about the word chair. Good. Then... There are too many muddy roads in the village. Mucharo haba imihanda nishi yigitaka. Muddy 
rods give it she told us an amazing story last week she told us an amazing story last week amazing story yatubwiye inkuru ishimishije inkuru nziza cyane mu cyumweru cyashize those are adjectives please adjectives are very important in a language because they help you try to explain the nouns you were talking about then please try to memorize the lesson try to grasp this lesson it is going to help you so much when you try to speak english in front of people you will be able to express yourself in a very wonderful way then after getting adjectives we are going to give you the last part of our lesson have you got the lesson very well nice after getting the lesson let us hear this wonderful saying reka twumve noneho mu byukuri iyi saying iyi mvugo yicyongereza in english we say don't be desperate don't be desperate do what you can do and let god do what you cannot do because god will not do what you can do may i repeat good don't be desperate do what you can do and let god do what you cannot do because god will not do what you can do don't be desperate do what you can do and let god do what you cannot do because god will not do what you can do bishatse kuvuga ngo wikwiheba ntukihebe kora ibyo ushoboye gukora ureke imana ikore ibyo udashoboye gukora kubera ko imana itazakora ibyo ushoboye gukora i thank you so much i am teacher jasper we are together don't be desperate please bye bye